the police chief of Iraq's Anbar province, where Islamic State militants are advancing, has been killed by a roadside bomb, officials say. Major General Ahmed Sadak was killed when the bomb targeted his convoy near the provincial capital Ramadi. In a separate attack, 22 Kurdish soldiers died in a triple car bomb attack in the eastern Daila province. Islamic State militants have seized large parts of Iraq and Syria in recent months, pushing back Iraqi forces. A security source told Reuters that the police chief was on patrol inspecting security forces in the Al Burisha area of Ramadi when two roadside bombs went off. Anbar province is the home of a growing insurgency by Sunni militants, including Islamic State. At a government compound in Karatba, northeast of Baghdad, three bombs killed 22 Kurds, many of them reported to be veteran fighters signing up for the battle against Is. A suicide bomber detonated his charge at the entrance to clear the way for two more car bombs that followed. The mayor of the town, Wahab Ahmed, says the attack was aimed at his office. On Saturday, a series of car bombs exploded in mainly Shia areas of the Iraqi capital Baghdad, killing at least 38 people. At least 75 people have been killed in attacks in various Iraqi cities this weekend. A U.S.-led coalition continues to carry out airstrikes against its targets in Iraq and Syria. In the besieged Syrian town of Koban, fighting between IS militants and Kurdish forces continued on Sunday. U.S. Defense Secretary Chuck Hagel said that U.S.-led airstrikes had made progress against the militants, but that they still occupied areas on the town's outskirts. More than 500 people are reported to have been killed in a month of conflict in and around the town.